Hi, welcome to Cultural Connection. I'm Nancy Commodoris, Cultural Arts Supervisor for the City of Farmington Hills. We're here today in the Farmington Players Barn Theater getting ready for the performance tonight of Three Men and a Tenor. And we are very fortunate to have uh, all of these guys here with us and to be able to talk with them individually today on the show. So, welcome. Uh, right now we have Chuck Colby here. Hey, Nancy. Hey, Chuck. And Chuck, uh, obviously you're the tenor. Uh, actually, I <laughs> am a man. Okay, you're one of the men. Yep. Okay. What a, what a great show you guys have, and I know mm. we've worked together in the past, and we're just thrilled to have you here in Farmington Hills, but it's your first Farmington Hills performance, right? This, this is our first Farmington Hills performance in quite a while. It, it has been uh, a couple years. We've performed in some of the schools uh, around okay. here before, and we also actually, uh, several years ago, uh, performed at a church uh, in the area. Mm. This, is, this is when we were getting started, probably 19... 90 some okay, uh, back then, yeah, yeah 19, <laughs> I think it was 1994 1995 uh -huh. uh, we played at uh, Narden Park uh, oh, yes. United Methodist Church my sure. my great aunt and uncle were uh, were members there and we we played for a uh, luncheon so I, I have really fond memories uh, of being here uh, in Farmington Hills before okay. well, we're looking forward to tonight because it's just going to be a fun show can you tell us a little bit about your show and what what it involves? Sure, absolutely. It's, you know, it's kind of a combination of a lot of different styles of music. Uh, you know, something as early as uh, the Mills Brothers and the Ink Spots, <laughs> Elvis, the Beatles, Led Zeppelin, Eric Clapton, Bob Marley, Garth Brooks, original songs of our own. And, and most of them uh, are done in, you know, sort of a unique way uh, so that it's, you know, definitely, definitely our song. And mm -hmm. you hear it and you say, oh, that's the three men and a tenor version. And it's, it's sort of, uh, we, we hope, unmistakable as, mm -hmm. as, as our sound. Uh, you know, it, like the Wonderful Tonight by Eric Clapton it is done not in the traditional <laughs> ballad way, but it's, it's actually turned into sort of a bouncy reggae uh, oh, really? song delivered in the style of Bob Marley. So it's, oh, it's that's definitely, uh, that's a unique piece. Sure, sure. Well, you always have your own spin on things, and that's why I think you're, your group is so unique, so very, very unique, and unique to Michigan, too. Yeah. So, and this, of course, is a smaller venue for you guys. If you could pick any one place you'd want to perform, where would you go? You know, that's an interesting thing to, to ask. Uh, we haven't really set our sights on any particular venue. Mm -hmm. uh, we've been kind of enjoying it as it comes uh, all along. We've been together for almost 19 years, and we've, we've played some great places uh, here in Michigan, uh, we've played in you know the the big performing arts centers, mm -hmm. uh, Wharton Center, Macomb Center, uh, Jackson Community College. Uh, there there are all these great great places, and that's always great. Uh, but it's also really cool to get to a place like this. I mean, we, you know, when we got together here today, everybody's looking out at the house and like, wow, this is going to be really neat tonight. Very mm -hmm. intimate. Yes. And I think people will uh, will really respond to that closeness. Uh, I remember early on one of our first shows uh, in Flint actually was at the Flint Cultural Center, not at not at Whiting, mm -hmm. um, which holds I think eighteen hundred people, uh, but at the Bauer Theater. And like this room, it's it's about a three hundred seat auditorium, mm -hmm. uh, and. Uh, it was, you know, in, in those days, one of the first shows that was actually sold out for us. And we're like, wait, we're sold out, woo! <laughs> uh, uh, but, uh, you know, it was, it was such a neat experience to have that proximity to everybody in the room. Mm -hmm. Where some of the big rooms, I'm looking at the back seat, the back row, and I'm thinking, we've played rooms where that's the front row, you know, at, at that distance. <laughs> sure. And it's, uh, it's really nice to be here. And of course, you enjoy interacting with the audience. Oh, very, you? very much so. You know, we'll probably get a couple people up on the stage tonight. Okay, I'll uh, hide. Uh, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. You know, we uh, one of the jokes when when I pull somebody up on the stage, I'll I'll generally say, you know, you you must have never been to a three minute tenor show before, and they say, why is that? And I said, you wouldn't have sat so close. <laughs> you know, that's uh, kind of funny. Well, you guys, as you mentioned, you've been together for 18 years. 18 years, yeah. What's kept you together all that time? That's, that's remarkable. You know, I, th I think it's, it's a number of different things. The, mm -hmm. the biggest thing that I think is underlying is that we all, we all love doing what we're doing. We love what it does for the audience. We, we love the feeling that we get back uh, for ourselves. I mean, it's, you know, that's the selfish reason is that it, it makes us feel good. Uh, but, but more than that, I mean, 
we, we definitely feel like we have sort of a sort of a mission and that we're doing something really uniquely positive mm -hmm. that uh, that the world really needs. I mean, well, I, you know, there's there's a song we sing in the show. Uh, it's a Doobie Brothers song. Listen to the music. And one of the lines in that song, I think, really sort of defines sort of the, the mission of our, of our group. It says, what the people need is a way to make them smile. Mm -hmm. And, you know, that's, that's truly what, what we try to offer. We try to offer, you know, good music paired with a, a fun night out and some comedy. And it really makes it a, it, a nice experience. People generally leave smiling. And it's so fun, uh, you know, because we, we get all different kinds of folks that come to the show. Uh, but my favorite is the uh, the husband who knows nothing about the show. Uh -huh. When it, when he shows up, and he gets here and he's like, <laughs> "What am I in for?" <sighs> you know, just waiting for the show to happen. Sure. And we can we look out through the curtains and we're like, "Okay, and there's one right there. <laughs> Doesn't know what's coming." And you know, like three songs into the show, these guys they they've gone from this to to like. Hey man, this, this is kind of fun, and, and all of a sudden they they're kind of engaged, and they let all the baggage of the week go, and they've they've had a great night uh, with their with their spouse, and it's uh, it that's that's a really rewarding thing is that we can we can reach these you know men who just hate the arts, <laughs> and you know and I understand I mean I there are things my wife wants to go to, and I'm like oh uh, I don't know I don't know about that yeah. Sure. But I think uh, guys, guys give it a try more often mm -hmm. uh, after they've been to our show and, and they say, you know what, that was, that was really fun. Uh, let's, let's do something else like that. Well, you've got such wide appeal. I think that's why everybody loves you so much. You hit all the different, yeah. all the different angles. And I, I, love, I love that too. You know, it's, yeah. you know, men, women, children, uh, you know, seniors. You know, we, we do a lot of shows in the winter where we travel to the south and to out west. Uh, and play for these active senior communities. And that's always so great because we actually encounter more people from Michigan there. <laughs> you know, uh, it's, it's amazing how many people uh, are out there in the winter. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's, it's really cool. Well, that's great. Well, I think, Chuck, we're going to bring on a couple of the other members right okay. now. And thanks for being here. And I can't wait till tonight. Our pleasure. Hey, thanks. Pleasure. Thanks for having us, Nancy. Okay. Thank you.